What's up everybody, it's Ray from Philly and Ray right here on New Year's Day 2017. Hope How's everyone is having a good New Year's. Uh, my last night watching those we got a package in yesterday that we're going to open today. I know what the, I, I, I bet I know what this is. It's part of this set, the 300 great cards of the 20th century by Mike Payne set. We're down in our man cave here again. Cool I, think I, know, I think I know who this is. Who is it? There's Rhett. Wait. 80. Wait. 1980 Tops George Brett Mint 9. Alright, let's take a quick look at it. 1980 Tops. Mm -hmm. George mm -hmm. Brett and a PSA Mint, Mint 9. I'll try for it to focus here. I love 1980 tops. They're really, really great cards. Let's see if I can. A little more awkward to try and do it down here, but and I'm hoping it's bright enough. Awkward. But the book says 1980 tops. Sometimes ball players hit the field in April and discover early on that it's just going to be their year. Danny McLean learned it in 1968, Steve Carlton in 19, and Ron Guidry learned it in 72 and 78, respectively. Mark McGuire and Sammy Sosa both learned it in 1998 as the nation watched their home run battle unfold. And George Brett learned it in 1980. Make no mistake, George Brett owned 1980. By August, Brett was hitting 400, and suddenly he was finding himself on the nightly news. Did Brett get a hit? Can he hit 400? Can anyone? Even though a rash of injuries, Brett battled and strung together a 37-game hitting streak. He finished the season at 390 with 24 homers, 118 RBIs, the highest batting average by a third baseman this century. So there you have it. That's the reason why. That's a great card. I remember that year the Phillies won the World Series, and they faced the Royals, and he was having a monster year. Also, we picked up this little trinket here. One dollar. From our LCS, this is the uh, a day to remember Sunday, June eighth, nineteen sixty nine, Yankee Stadium, when uh, Mickey Mantle, I guess, retired. So it's just something we're gonna put up here in our main sports cave down here. So there you have it. One more quick look at this card. <laughs> Eighty tops, George Brett, PSA nine. All right, folks. Bye, folks. Vacation is over <laughs> for me tomorrow. I go back to work Tuesday. Oh, and I got this hat hey, today. Today's Sunday. Thanks to Caesar, Phil's fan, P H I L Z fan, uh, told me about a store in Center City, Philadelphia, called Shy Vintage Sports. I was able to get this Philadelphia A's hat down there. Uh, this is the 1929. Philadelphia championship season ace hat. So there you go. I'm a, I'm a big ace collector. So <laughs> talk to everybody soon. Happy, ha have a happy new year.